Welcome to Lecture Online. The question, what produces ENM waves or electromagnetic waves? ENM is short for electromagnetic. Well, the answer usually comes to, oh, the sun does, and you're indeed correct. The sun does produce electromagnetic radiation. It produces ultraviolet radiation, visible light, and infrared radiation. Uh, light bulbs do, fluorescent light bulbs do. And radio antennas, I try to draw a radio antenna here, but yes, the radio antenna broadcasts are produced via a very tall, sometimes a three, four, five hundred feet tall antenna uh, towers that produces electromagnetic radiation. So that's usually what we think about. But it turns out other things produce electromagnetic radiation as well, and that's sometimes very, very surprising. You can have a brick sitting around like that, and sure enough, a brick will produce electromagnetic radiation. People, we, we produce electromagnetic radiation. Houses, everything in the houses, the couches and the floors and the ceilings and you name it, the bathtub, the stove, anything in the house, everything and anything in the house produces electromagnetic creation. And what's even more surprising, ice cubes in a drink or the ice cubes in your refrigerator or in your freezer, they also produce electromagnetic radiation. Bottom line, everything in the universe, without exception, everything in the universe and of course, when I say without exception, I may be saying something wrong. That maybe there's something out there that don't produce electromagnetic radiation. But as far as I know, everything in the universe produces electromagnetic radiation. And that is surprising. And so, if that's the case, if everything produces electromagnetic radiation, we should be able to learn something from the object by studying that electromagnetic radiation coming from it. Matter of fact, when a doctor puts this little thing in your ear, and then one or two seconds later, the thing goes beep, and they look at it, it actually measures the temperature of your body by measuring the electromagnetic radiation coming out of your ear. So knowing that and understanding that can lead us to help, or at least can help us understand what's happening in the universe, and that's what it's all about. So now you know what produces electromagnetic radiation. Your answer is everything in the universe. Now that we know that, you may wonder, well, how does it do that? How does a brick produce electromagnetic radiation? How does a person produce electromagnetic radiation? How does anything, ice cubes, produce electromagnetic radiation? If you want to know the answer to that, you have to watch the next video.